little bit of a soul Friday is here, the weekend is here, and of course the angels will never leave us alone, right? They are here for us with their love, with their light, to enlighten this weekend with their protection, with their inspirations. That's good, right? Anyways, we're receiving guidance for Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. It's March 22nd, 22nd, 23rd, and 24th, 2019. For those of you who don't know me, hi, my name is Maria. It's a pleasure to receive you here. And I'm here, as you can see, to connect you with your angels on a daily basis, to bring them closer to you, to help you feel their energy and their health, to help you understand that they are indeed here for you. So if you're interested in this, click the subscribe button below and in the bell also so you can be notified when a new video, when a new guidance comes through, okay? So we are going to go on and get the um, Oracle deck for life changes again. As you know, we are going through a lot of changes right now. The energy this week is all about this, all about changes, it's all about alignment, it's all about embracing human experience to spiritual experience so we are using different decks throughout the week if you haven't watched the other guidances during this week go ahead and watch it as well because then things will make sense to you all right but fair enough let's get to our guidance and let's see what they want to tell us for the weekend it's good to use this one for the weekend because then they can give us really uh, practical things to do for the weekend so let's see this okay here it is so we have ooh, relationship dynamics you see it's such a beautiful card i love this deck the, the images are so beautiful so relationship dynamics my dear this is all about taking time this weekend to really bring this energy of changes to your relationships first of all your relationship with yourself which means taking good care of yourself, okay? Enjoy this weekend, but do the things that you truly want, okay? Listen to your heart. Your heart is asking you to take care of, of yourself, so do it, okay? Don't ignore yourself. Take your time this weekend to commit to yourself, to do something good for you, to nourish you, to simply be at peace a little bit, okay? To really embrace a little bit of this divine, lights that we are all receiving now okay and this is also about relationship with other people of course okay changing these relationships it's important right now and it's important for you to understand as well that all these energies we are receiving with the equinox with the full moon and everything that is going on energetically uh, in the planet to the planet right now this is affecting us in all levels this like i told you before this is really alignment so you will begin to experience shifts and changes in, the, in your relationships the way you uh, connect with people some people might be coming out of your life you might feel you might see that some people naturally live your life naturally become far further from you and some people get closer some people get stronger connected with you so those who are vibrating in your will stick close by but those who don't vibrate like you are vibrating now they will begin to fade away and it's normal it's natural embrace this allow this to happen because this is for your highest good okay don't grab yourself don't you know don't keep holding on to things and to people that are not in alignment with you that are not there for you that are not making anything positive it's not there is no exchange of energy happening it's only giving of energy happening so they are asking you take this opportunity of changes to allow these changes to also be shower uh, your relationships as well okay it's it's important to really embrace you know and to really nourish the relationships that really matter to really give attention to those who you truly love to those who truly love you too 
So use this weekend to strengthen these relationships with your family, with your friends, with people you really care for. Use this opportunity to be closer to them and to go out to do things with them that you know it's gonna just keep that beautiful flow of love in between you two or all of you. Okay, so they're asking you to really focus this weekend in relationships in general with yourself and with the world. Okay, think about this and think about what you can do to change this, what you can do to, to make these relationships stronger and more aligned with divine love, okay, for yourself and for others. Okay, what can happen? Which relationships actually are there to help you be in alignment? Because if you think about it, there are people near you who are not helping you in this alignment, who are not, who are not helping you to be in harmony. And these are the relationships that you have to let them go. Release. They will go away by themselves. It's not about fighting, it's not about breaking up, it's not about, you know, having any kind of major, deeper uh, hurt at some level. But this is about simply releasing, allowing people to come and go to your lines, allowing people to stay if they want to and to go if they want to. Allow people to have their free will because you have yours. So use your free will to love yourself, to have a better relationship with who you are, so then the relationships around you will begin to shift as well. The dynamics of the relationships, the energies of these relationships will begin to shift as well. Okay, my dear? Anyways, I hope this makes sense to you and this is touching your heart. I hope this makes you think about it and think about yourself a little bit more this weekend. Take good care of your heart because you're receiving so much light and so much love from the universe these days. So just embrace this and allow this to flow through you. Okay, take good care of yourself, beautiful soul. And thank you for being here. Enjoy your weekends. Enjoy yourself. Enjoy, enjoy the people you love. And I'll talk to you now on Monday with the next guidance. Have a great day. Namaste.